So now we're of course inside the, the uh, 336 VRK Sport Trek Touring. Uh, we've made a couple small small adjustments to it. We've made this island or the, the, the kitchen countertop area a little bit different. Uh, this was, was all one level before and it came out a little bit further. Uh, we were having some countertop issues, uh, that kind of stuff. So we've now made this two-piece countertop made this a little bit smaller so you have more room here but still of course plenty of room plenty of countertop space um, in this unit as you look at the kitchen here of course you know you've got your sink strainers that come in every unit i'll leave the plastic on so everybody's kind of switched to these sink strainers here the last couple of years which is nice for drying dishes that kind of stuff but now what you don't have is we in the past we always had a sink cover which also worked as a cutting board so you lose your your sink cover slash cutting board there but what we've done in return is we have designed this venture butcher block cutting board that also sits inside the sink so if you want to use it as a cutting board and put it on the sink and push all your scrap right into the sink or the trash can, you can there, right there. Of course, you've got the Furion uh, larger 21 inch um, oven here with the new grates on top for the stove top itself. So they have switched the top before you had... Um, three burners here that had individual grates. What's nice about this new style of grate, uh, kind of looks more commercial or industrial, is they can actually put a cast iron pan on here and it will do the proper cooking temperature with cast iron pan where with the old style, that was not, you could not do that with cast iron. Um, big drawer underneath the fridge here. Plenty of pots, pan storage, big drawer underneath the oven as well. Left of the fridge, you've got adjustable pantry shelves. You can adjust them however you want. As you come around, you'll see the, the dining room table here. Um, you'll also notice to the left of that, big, huge entertainment center. Um, Two fireplaces are standard in all Sport Trek Touring floor plans. You'll have one in the living room, one in the bedroom, which you will see later. Of course, they, they give off heat. They've got all different types of colors. As you're looking here, you got your radio hidden. One less thing you got to look at. Plenty of storage above this entertainment center. Um, I'm, I'm 6'1", and I'm reaching all the way back into it. That's how big spot it is for storing stuff of course you got your theater seats over here uh, the new style theater seats you got your center console flip it down um, two cup holders you've got an outlet here two USB ports everybody needs USB ports these days for the computers cell phones that kind of stuff and then on both sides of the theater seats you also have a USB port along with your control for massage or heat or both as we come around the rest of the living area living space here you've got a tri-fold sofa which folds out into a full-size uh, sleeping bed that is also both of these the theater seats and the tri-fold in this floor plan is standard as you come back towards the bathroom area here of course we've got our little hidden safety store box Perfect place to put keys, cell phones, that kind of stuff. Be done with it for the weekend. It also has an outlet and two USB ports. We come around to the bathroom here. You're going to see this little sticker. Um, if it is optioned with the solar panels themselves. This sticker won't be here. It will be the actual monitor that tells you everything. But if you do not, or if your dealer doesn't stock it with the solar panels, 
then of course everything's right here it's pre-wired all i have to do is cut this out insert it just coming to the bathroom here um you'll notice you've got your step in uh rectangle shower new shower head new faucet um, new style curtain door sliding curtain door new sink um, of course every toilet or every unit that we make has a porcelain toilet for adventure as you walk towards the bedroom or into the bedroom here you'll see right here is a new upgrade for us made this switch a couple months ago um, they can literally download the app under their smartphone and sync it by putting the phone right here within about five seconds so they can operate all of this stuff if they want to from their cell phone if not of course everything's everything is right here um, this unit has three slides it's all right here you select between the slides it has two awnings you select between the two awnings and of course you got your all your lights you got um, your tank monitor all this right here nice new feature that we decided to do this year if we walk into the bedroom of course majority of the sport trek touring floor plans all but um, three of them have true residential king beds this one is one of the ones that has a king bed with a slide this cabinet over here when you come around of course you got hanging you know hanger or a curtain rod up there to hang clothes but also on the left side the left wall you will see that it is prepped and wired and plumbed right here for a combo washer and dryer it's very hard to find in travel trailers prepped and plumbed and prepped wired and plumbed for washer and dryer Again, I mentioned earlier, every sport truck touring comes with two fireplaces, one in the living room, one in the bedroom. Independently controlled, of course. Um, nice size dresser here, three big drawers, perfect space underneath to put your shoes, dog bowls, anything like that. As you're looking out towards the front of the coach from the inside here, you'll see that's where your automotive windshield is. That's on the front cap. Gorgeous, nice little seating area. Um, a lot of people actually are calling it a day bed. Um, I've known, I've been told that kids sleep there, dogs sleep there. Perfect place to do some reading. As you look at this a little more detail up here, you'll notice you got more storage and a shelf down on both sides, an outlet on both sides, and then on this side you have two USB ports. Again, more room for hanging clothes, curtain rod on both sides, storage, storage. Above the bed, you actually have two cabinet doors. In the middle, you've got the archway there. You've got two outlets and two USB ports.